very disrespectful. What's up, my name is Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, I want to introduce you guys to a stock that is getting disrespected. I mean, very, very disrespected. Uh, when you think about companies that are solid, companies that um, always have business coming in, you're thinking about uh, companies that do business with the government, the military, uh, maybe some commercial businesses. Um, you can, you're talking about companies that uh, focus on things that uh, not everybody can easily get up and, and start making. So um, I'm, I'm talking about companies that work in maybe um, aerospace, um, that provide services and provide uh, systems for uh, maybe planes, for military stuff, for the government. So a company that is actually in that space that um, the stock price is really now, in, in my opinion, um, about 50% of and nobody is talking about this stock and the, it's a dividend paying stock that I'm looking like, why are people not talking about this stock? And, and the only reason why I think it's not getting the respect that it's supposed to uh, is just that people don't know. So if you are a dividend investor and you are looking for something that you can get on right now that has a potential for growth, I mean, not just a small potential, but a massive potential for growth, this stock that I'm about to introduce you to is something that you should start uh, thinking about. So um, again, uh, when you consider the things that you want to buy or the stocks that you want to buy, I'm looking at their competition. Like, hey, who is the competition in this space? Um, do you have business? Is your business always guaranteed? Um, so especially when you do business with the government, most often than not, um, governments spend money a ton on uh, defense, uh, on their military, and so chances are there's always going to be business for this company. Ladies and gentlemen, I know you're probably asking yourself, Mr. V, just go ahead already and tell me the stock because I'm ready to buy. But before you do that, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, and how to invest and build wealth. And if that's something that really interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so that you don't miss out on new content. So let's jump back into it. So this company again that I'm telling you about right now, um, it's currently trading at a, about $67 um, by the time I was making this video. And the 52 week high shows that this stock can go up to about $160. So think about it. If you get it at 67 and it goes up to 150, that's almost over 50% return for this one stock. And then on top of that, they pay really good dividends. So not only are you getting the, the, the growth that it's gonna come with buying the stock, but you're also getting dividends on a quarterly basis. And here's why I really, really like this stock. This is a, a company that has um, some competition, but very minimal competition. So it's not like um, there's 10, 15, 20 of them around the country. No, there's very few of them um, in the space that they operate. So they have one massive competition, but they still have a good chunk of the market. So drum roll, I'm about to reveal to you my secret stock, ticket symbol RTX. This is a company that operate in the provision of uh, military um, services and, and systems um, to uh, you know governments and defense department to some commercial uh, customers and right now it's currently trading at 67 dollars a share 52 week high like i mentioned earlier that's 155 dollars so if you go in that is a good place Again, this is my personal take. This is a company that I love. I'm just sharing it with you guys. So if you're thinking of buying or investing in this company, um, invest at your own demise. I don't want you to come back to me tomorrow. It's like, oh, Mr. V, you said this stock was going to go up and it never went up. That never happens when the stock goes up. When it goes up, everybody's like, hmm, that was awesome. But when it goes down, that's when I get all these hit mail from YouTube. Like, you said this stock was gonna go up and it never went up. Or with my Instagram, people tell me like, oh, you said this stock was gonna go up and never went up. But when it goes up, you don't call me and be like, hey, Mr. V, I'm gonna cash app you uh, 50 bucks for that recommendation. 
right? It never happens that way. But again, guys, this is a stock that I really love. I have it in my dividend portfolio and I'm adding to my position because I know and I, I know that there's huge upside to this stock. Um, again, like I said, right now, the key competition is Lockheed Martin. So this is another company that works with defense department, um, aerospace, and, 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 and just work with uh, both uh, governments and uh, commercial customers. Lucky Martin is, I think, trading over $350 right now, a massive guy. Um, so RTX is not as big as Lucky, but it has an opportunity for growth, especially when things get back to normal, we get back to doing business as usual. Even if this stock goes just back to its 52 week high, you are gonna be sitting pretty good. So that's my take. What do you think about RTX? Have you researched it or do you have it in your portfolio? Let me know in the comment section. If you have any question again about this particular stack, my opinion, don't hesitate to leave them in the comment section. And as always guys, like, share, subscribe. YouTube tells me that 90% of you guys watching haven't already subscribed to my channel. So if you do me a favor, Take a second, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell right to it so that you don't miss out on new content. And as always, stay motivated.